With no real story of its own, Minecraft allows itself to be open to players creating their own stories. This allows the individuality of players to intertwine with the game's mechanics. But first, let me take you on the journey of my first day in Minecraft. I was so scared of the nights. I had watched Paul Soares Jr. How to Survive and Thrive series. My anticipation was astounding. I expected to be killed, my loot lost, and a feeling of game over to arise at any moment. I found a cliff near the spawn and mined it out with a wooden pickaxe. I found the coal on the side of the cliff face as I was mining. I used this to make torches. Then I created a door, a crafting table, and then a furnace. By now it was night, my fear setting in. I was held up until my base until dawn. Do you understand? Minecraft's neo-retro graphics, simple sound effects, and a low skill floor gameplay allows for one's imagination to run wild. It allows this story to continue regardless of experience. It creates engaging tales that are interesting to watch even in third person. It is in the eye of the beholder, the mind's eye, through the player's nervous system from the toes to the top of their head. A full body experience from a game you thought was just for kids, just for simpletons. This couldn't be any further from the truth. Minecraft, as a procedural game, is a master of storytelling. Let's examine this further. A story consists of a plot and characters. A plot has a rising action, a climax, falling action, and periods of rest. Characters are beings which fill the world with life, and Minecraft checks all these boxes. Let's first examine Minecraft's plot. One can feel the rising action as they enter a cave, for example. A climax when you hear a creeper hissing behind you, or when you find diamonds at the end of a long expedition. And periods of falling action occur when a player, filled with adrenaline, is greeted by a wonderful, most brilliant soundtrack. And overall, Minecraft can be a very peaceful game, giving many periods of rest. Now for the characters. Minecraft's plethora of characters has only expanded in the recent years. With the advent of mob votes, the community has even had a say of what's added to the game. From zombies to skeletons and creepers, phantoms and golems, villagers and pillagers, Minecraft has no shortage in the character set department. This feeds into the plot of the game as well as the imagination of the player. Overall, Minecraft is a game that tells as many stories as there are worlds to explore. And while there are more worlds, more updates, and more players, there will always be more stories to be told in the world's best-selling game.